to my kitchen. So today we're gonna to be shooting the video inside my house because we're gonna be talking about why you should have a light mounted to your weapon system for home security. On the road to 100K, we're gonna be doing all kinds of videos, including Tactical Tuesdays, never on a Tuesday, police cars, we've got California Highway Patrol coming up, and much, much more. So before we start today's video, just wanna mention Olight sent me these two lights, including some accessories uh, to go over and do a review. These two uh, lights they sent are the same model. It's the Olight PL Pro Valkyrie. However, one is in desert tan and one is in black. These are the two colors that this model comes in. So the max lumens on the Valkyrie PL Pro are 1500. 1500 lumens, woo! And the max throw is 280 meters. So almost three football fields. All right, so inside the box, in the back here, what you're gonna get in the package, I'm gonna pull it out, I have it already pulled out for time. We have right here is it's charger. It's a rechargeable battery. Um, some lights, they take double A's. Some take those little CR uh, batteries. This one is rechargeable and it has a magnetic strip here and has a USB uh, just like any other thing made these days that you can plug it into a brick, then plug it into a wall, or you can plug it into something like your car that has a USB uh, charger. Also on the back of the package, you have a Glock rail adapter and a 1913 rail adapter. So you can change between the two. It comes with a little wrench key there so you can take it off and on. Cool thing I like about these lights are the quick detach and mounting system that's here. It's real simple to put on. Before I start manipulating the weapon system, let you guys know everything's safe, clear, and empty. It's not loaded. To mount it, simple. Just open it up, press down, bam, and we're mounted. And to take it off, sun clip, press in, and it's off. So it's very quick. Look, I'm not even, I can't even see that side. Very quick, very easy. On there's 30, nice flush contact, good to go. So if you have multiple weapons or multiple guns, multiple firearms in your house, uh, take it off, put it on, and move it between uh, the different firearms. So if you notice on the light, the, to turn it on, there's a little button right here towards your finger lands. Just one press in, turns it on. Notice on the other side of the weapon system, you have it there as well. So it's ambidextrous. You could do it with both hands. You could do it with your grip hand if you want. Uh, double click, leaves it on. That's called the silent ambidextrous on and off switch. Fancy name. Also comes with a magnetic pressure remote switch. So how this works, this is for rifles. How it works is on the bottom, you have another magnetic attachment. It'll go here and then now you can control the light with just a press of this button right here. So this would be attached to your rifle either on the bottom or the top, wherever you decide to, to mount it. And then you can control the light this magnetic strip here. They also include two zip ties to keep this uh, wire nice and neat. So that was just a quick rundown of the Olight Valkyrie PL Pro. Olight wanted me to let you guys know that they're gonna be having a Black Friday sale. It's starting the 28th, goes through the 30th, where you can pick up these. Um, pretty much every Olight product is gonna be on sale. All the way up 45%, I saw some deals. They also have some bundles. Um, for all new customers, you guys are gonna receive a free i3e EOS. Now this little guy packs a punch. Bam! Woo, look at that thing, that thing is bright. So this little uh, keychain light will be included for all new customers. Returning customers, have no fear, they have a free gift for you as well. So I'm gonna put all the information down below in a link. So you guys can follow it there, go get your deals. If you are on the fence of buying a light, now is the time to do it. Um, they make really good lights. I mean, they're all over the internet. You guys should already know Olight. If you're into guns or into gear, you already know what Olight's about. They make some serious lights. All right, I also wanted to give a huge shout out to Frank Castle Customs for, for providing us with these awesome guns here. Take a look at these guns. So the owner of Frank Castle Customs is actually a law enforcement officer that works with me. Uh, I follow him on Instagram. You guys can follow him at Frank Castle Customs. He specializes in full customization of Glock, Sig, Sours, Smith & Wesson, and more. So I follow his stuff on Instagram. I reached out to him and said, hey man, uh, you mind lending me some guns? So he's like, hey, no problem. Lending me these two guns, one with a sweet Punisher skull on the grip here of the Sig Sour, and then the Glock here 
with the Trijicon sights, um, all kinds of customization going on through here, all the way from the barrel to the slide to the grip. Sweet, sweet setup. So again, Frank Castle Customs. If you guys want to check them out, Frank Castle Customs on Instagram or go to the website, frankcastlecustoms.com. Oh boy, Frank, good looking out, man. Now that we got those plugs out of the way, let's talk about the reason that you clicked on this video. I'm gonna give you guys three reasons why I believe um, you should have a light mounted to your weapon system for uh, personal protection at home. If you guys disagree with me, I encourage a conversation down in the comments or we can go back and forth. Maybe you have a different take on why you should not have a light on your weapon system. I wanna hear from you guys. So if you do, or you wanna join the discussion, or you, you got more to add to it, I'm only gonna do three, um, cause I wanna make this a shorter video, but if you got more you wanna to add to it, let's have a discussion down in the comments below. I encourage you guys to join in and share the knowledge. Picture this, it's late at night, you're sleeping in your bed, and you hear a noise downstairs. If you're like me, you'll have your weapon close to you by the nightstand or in a vicinity where you can get it really quickly. Without a light mounted to your weapon system, you're gonna be moving through the house probably when it's dark. Now I'll give you the uh, tactical advantage of concealment as you're moving through the house. It will be harder to pick you up. Your eyes will be adjusted to the nighttime, but however, you're gonna be at a disadvantage on identifying what it is that's in front of you. Now if you live at home, and there's nobody else that lives with you or you're with your wife or your husband and they're sleeping right next to you, then you shouldn't really have anything to worry about because nobody should be in your house. Now, if you have a family with children or you live with your parents and somebody is up in the house, this is where you might wanna consider running a light on your weapon system. When you're woken from a dead sleep, it, your mind is not thinking the same as it was if you're up in midday. So it's hard to process some information. So if you're in a house with other family members, you might run a chance of having a tragic incident take place. Now there's an argument that when you're pointing your light, you're also pointing your gun and you're moving through your house and you're running a chance of pointing your gun at a family member. The argument to that is if you're walking around your house with no light on your weapon and you're clearing rooms, you're still gonna be pointing your weapon at whoever's there, which could be your family member. My argument is, I'd want to know who it is so I can identify them and either engage or disengage my firearm towards that person. Reason numero dos. If you're walking around the house with a flashlight in your hand and not attached to your weapon system, well, you now you just took out your non-dominant hand out of the game. So with a traditional light, if you're moving around your house in the dark, uh, you might have to negotiate objects or obstacles such as a stool. Negotiate means to move around. So if you have to move around a stool, you go down, move it with your non-dominant hand, you just took your light out of the game. Something as simple as opening a door at nighttime, if I'm twisting the knob and open it up, I'd want to have my light blinding whatever it is that I'm about to open the door up on so I can identify what it is. And not only that, it gives me a tactical advantage because my light is blinding them, they might not be able to see what it is. But if my flashlight is in my non-dominant hand and not attached to my weapon system, then I lose that at advantage that I have once I open up the door to see what's inside. So that's reason numero dos. And reason number three. If you guys notice, once I activate the light, there's a white circle where the light's hitting. That white circle, we'll call it the hot spot. I can use this hot spot as my advantage because I know more or less that the center of that hot spot or where my rounds are gonna land. So in the middle of the night, it might be hard to pick up these sights. Um, you just need to know that in the middle of your circle, on the hot spot, that's where your rounds are gonna land. So that's an advantage of running a light on your weapon system. That's reason numero three. All right, so there you have it. Three reasons why you should run a light on your weapon system. If you guys enjoyed the video, please hook it up. Give a brother a thumbs up. If you have anything to add or you disagree with something that I said, let's talk about it in the comment section. Also, if you guys wanna discuss the advantages of carrying a mounted light on patrol. Uh, I'm down for a video like that. We can incorporate that on another Tuesday. But never on a Tuesday. And one last shout out to my boy Frank over at Frank Castle Customs. Uh, thanks for hooking it up with these firearms. So remember, now's the time to head over to Olight to check out the deals that they're gonna be having. Again, the 28th 
through the 30th, all kinds of deal, Black Friday deals. Go and pick up the lights. With that being said, I'll see you when I see you. And if I don't see you, then I'll see you.